Man, strict diet. Doc's orders. Too sweet for me. Yeah, my cousin's visiting this weekend. From California. Night, huh? Perfect weather, smell of hot dogs, people laughing. Look, you can kind of even see the stars up there. Pretty sure that's a plane. It is nice. Now that you mention it, you don't get out enough. Well, hey, now that I'm back, it can be like old times. Just the three of us painting the town something. You know the saying. Red. Red. <laughs> Sorry, my head's all over the place. No, I'm right about those stars. <laughs> this place feels so much smaller now. Been forever. Tickets were so much cheaper ten years ago. But kitty allowances made it hurt twice as much. True. just wander around. People watch. I honestly don't remember the last time we let ourselves relax for a night. It seems like it's been forever. Stuff just always gets in the way. Man, Pete, you must have had one packed tutoring schedule. Huh. Yeah, I guess so. You two have always had your noses to the grindstone. Sometimes you gotta stop and smell the roses. Says the guy who started a foundation two seconds after finishing life-saving medical treatment. I know how lucky I am to have gotten a second chance. I have a responsibility to make the most of it. Work hard, play hard. Okay, kind of random, but hear me out. Halloween this year. Group costume. Group costume. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, okay, okay. I, I might be getting ahead of myself, but I'm seeing a lot of Spider-Man stuff around recently. Is there something there? Morph suits are pretty affordable. Yes, see, that's why I hired you, Pete. Innovative thinking. So it's settled then. This year's theme, the gang becomes heroes. <laughs> Perfect. everything. Hey, there's a prize with our name on it. I didn't realize how excited I'd be to ride the speed demon again. Is it bad that I feel too old to ride the carousel? That might be the saddest thing I've heard all day. <laughs> I'll be sure to bring it up in therapy. <sighs> everything okay? After you. <laughs> Such a gentleman. Doing okay? I'm really nervous. Don't worry about it. What are the chances the person Harry gave his prize to would be the single writer sitting next to him? 
I mean, it would be one heck of a meet cute. Should we tell her? Tell her what? What are you two whispering about up there? <laughs> Just ah! reminding MJ to keep her hands inside the vehicle at all times. Showcase of the night. The muscle up. Oh, you know it, baby. I never did hit that bell, but the dream always kept me coming back. I think this will be the year. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. Closed? Ugh, saved by the renovations. Now here's a strapping young lad. Welcome! Who's up first? Pete, come on. <gasps> nice! Take it easy, Harry. Don't hurt yourself. The only thing that's gonna hurt is your Parker pride. Boys, boys. You're both pretty. <laughs> uh, sorry. <sighs> what? Um, okay. I guess this really was the year. Harry, that was something else. <sighs> yeah, I have no idea how I did that. Okay, how about we do something more chill? Looks like the Ferris wheel line has died down, so. Is that a dunk tank? That's new. Uh, thanks, but it's gonna be a hard pass for me on the dunk. Really? You used to be really into swimming. Didn't you win state? It's like you said, MJ, people can change. Thanks, Pete. Okay, I know we promised no real life talk, but I need one hall pass. MJ, you have to come by EMF. You can check out Pete's new office. Ugh, I know, I have to. But I've been so busy trying to impress Jonah. Her boss. Wait, but Jonah Jameson? Yeah. Slimy shock jock Jonah is telling you what to do? Uh, only if I want to stay employed. 
We really did need a night out. Night, huh? Perfect weather, smell of hot dogs, people laughing. Look, I can kind of even see the stars up there. Pretty sure that's a plane. It is nice. Now that you mention it, we don't get out enough. Well, hey, now that I'm back, it can be like old times. Just the three of us painting the town something. You know the saying. Red. Red. <laughs> no, no, I... Sorry, my head's all over the place. <sighs> I know I'm right about those stars. <laughs> They've really upped their merch game, huh? It's cooler than the candy dispenser I got the first time I came here. I bet you still have it, though. Yeah. Good, Pete. <laughs> you know I'm never taking this off, right? You're gonna wear that to the office. Co-founder approved. I know, I told him the same thing. Go for it. Gotta stay loose. Big wheeling, right. You gonna check that out? Do you have anything spicy or It's so nice to just wander around, people watch. I honestly don't remember the last time we let ourselves relax for a night. Seems like it's been forever. Stuff just always gets in the way. Man, Pete, you must have had one packed tutoring schedule. Huh. Yeah, I guess so. You two have always had your noses to the grindstone. Sometimes you gotta stop and smell the roses. Says the guy who started a foundation two seconds after finishing life-saving medical treatment. I know how lucky I am to have gotten a second chance. I have a responsibility to make the most of it. Work hard, play hard. I feel so much smaller now. And forever. Tickets were so much cheaper ten years ago. But kitty allowances made it hurt twice as much. True. <laughs> wow, this place really hasn't changed a bit. Yeah. A little worn down, but the endorphins are the same. I wonder if the food is as good as I remember. Sure smells like it. Uh, Pete, the last hot dog you ate gave you food poisoning. Oh, yeah. Isn't it crazy that in another universe I wouldn't be here with you guys? I'd just be gone. Dead, I guess, or still in treatment. Or... Well, luckily, we're in the best timeline then. No kidding. I just. This is a great night. I'm really happy we're all here. But I'm here. Oh no. Side effects of your treatment may include becoming an extreme cheese ball. Actually, that's a side effect of hanging out with you. Ooh, burn! <laughs> I missed you, buddy. Oh! Okay, 
kind of random, but hear me out. Uh, yeah. Halloween this year. Group costume. Group costume. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, okay, okay. I might be getting ahead of myself, but I'm seeing a lot of Spider-Man stuff around recently. Is there something there? Morph suits are pretty affordable. Yes, see, that's why I hired you, Pete. Innovative thinking. So it's settled then. This year's theme, the gang becomes heroes. Perfect. Right behind you. I'm gonna let you two go ahead and be cute together. I'm gonna go see if I can win a couple more unicorns. <laughs> you look really happy. It's funny. Harry's getting a second chance, but I feel like I'm getting one, too. You two are gonna make a hell of a team. <laughs> the Bugle posted. Did Jonah put you on the front page? Oh, you're gonna be an editor! I should have brought champagne. Hunters and scorpions and explosions, oh my. Jonah posted the new guy's story. MJ, uh, yeah. It already has 5,000 views. <sighs> I've got to write a different kind of story. Win his trust, somehow. Hey, you come up with something. You always do. Thanks. Sure. And, hey! If you need some help from your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man, I'd say we make a hell of a team, too. Even if I do forget the champagne. Next time. This way. Out of the way. Eyes on Tombstone. Tombstone. Squad, huh? Which super villain are you hunting this time? Mysterio? Tombstone? Don't let the spider get in our way. Take him out. Didn't expect to see me? Well, the feeling's mutual. One night off. That's all I wanted. But no. Come in. Come in. Containing Tombstone as much as we can. But we cannot. Surprise. Whose fault is to kidnap me with a little rope and the power of friendship? Tombstone can handle himself. You can't take on all of us. Can't let them hurt anyone who hasn't gotten out of the park yet. Oh no, Harry! Come on, Harry, pick up, pick up! Hey, it's Harry. Leave a message. MJ, Harry isn't answering his phone. I've got my hands full with these hunters, and I don't see him anywhere. Ferris Wilpot is about to touch down. I'll make sure he's safe. And you stay safe, too. <laughs> you know I don't go anywhere without my Simkarian sidekick. Is that what you call your sable stingray? Still workshopping it. I'll let you know when I find Harry. Changing position. Target sighted. <laughs> <laughs> There 
moving in on the raceway. That's where Tombstone was working. He's tough, but so are these guys. Hunter, start your engines! And may the best spider win! I knew he'd be at the race time. Spider-Man or Tombstone? Take him to ground! When I get... MJ, you found Harry? Not yet, but I saw Mysterio. Raven's Gun Squad doesn't seem to be interested in him. Like, at all. And they must only want Tombstone. Thanks for the tip! Yeah. I'll keep looking for Harry. Taking the shot! <laughs> There really is some reinforcements here. Additional units are on their way. Joke! Get rid of right. I got these guys, Tombstone. You just worry about breaking through that net! Never thought I'd see the day you defend me! You and me both, Lonnie. But these guys' his boss wants you dead. He's a hunter, and he's making supervillains his prey. I'm guessing he's not open to a call from my parole officer about how I turned my life around. Since he's already killed Scorpion? Probably not! Stay located! Get the spider off our back, once and for all! Nice, nice try, Spidey. We're ready this time. You can't stay up there forever! Sorry, Lonnie. I really do want to help you. It's gonna be. 
be okay. I sure do. Spider-Man? I know, I know. But first, what are those things coming out of you? I think it's my treatment. <laughs> Dr. Connor said it's some kind of self-learning exosuit, but I had no idea it could... Wait. You know what this means, right? We both have superpowers. Just think about all the stuff we could do to heal the world. Sorry. I uh, guess I still got to figure out how this thing works. Well, it's a real shame neither of us has a state-of-the-art science lab to run some tests. I'll go make sure the coast is clear. Meet you there. Give me a call when you're ready. I saw what happened at Coney. What was that? Well, uh, remember my friend Harry? Yeah? That was him? How? Honestly, no idea. I think it's this treatment he's been... Oh, that's Harry. Gotta go. Hey, I cleared out the foundation. All right, I'll swing by. <laughs> 
swing by. Man, how many times have you said that and meant it literally? My pleas for peace have been rejected by calls for violence. From, you know it, Spider-Man. An attack on what was once a destination for enjoyment now stands desecrated and defiled. Our cherished Coney Island was victim to a free-for-all brawl destroying iconic attractions and history itself. Some of my fondest memories were Coney Island. My father used to buy me the nickel pop and hot dog combo, and I, like any self-respecting American, would overindulge. Now, it's all been taken from me. To make matters worse, Spider-Man seems to have brought a new friend along for his night on the town. Just what this city needs. Another vigilante to take the law into their own hands. If one person wasn't enough for you to corrupt Spider-Man, you need two acolytes to do your bidding? Add to the pile of unpleasantness, the Hunters and reformed criminal Lonnie Lincoln, a.k.a. Tombstone, and you have a recipe for the ruination of any normal person just trying to have a night out. These Hunters are clearly after the Spider-Men, and any of their accomplices. They're as much a blight on this city as the heroes protecting it. I'm sure old glory Mayor Grant loves what this does for tourism. Spider-Man! Get the whip! Does anyone have sunscreen? We can Will one of you do my back, please? Crystal time. Crystal 
crystal turn. I find them, and they're waiting for me. With all sorts of weapons. What the hell have I walked into? The hunters were after him. No wonder he got scared. Craven's tech is no joke. You guys be in an hourglass or something? <laughs> Clear now. They're circling me, Miha. Oh, wishing I just stayed home with you and came here. Helped you with your homework. Made you the one meal that I know how to cook. But it's too late now. Marco fell right into their trap. But wait, Kimia's his kid? How did I not know about this? Check back in on Marco. He's steadily improving, making more and more sense. He's even eating again. Doctors are hopeful. Good work. coming in from Brooklyn are to be believed. These Spider-Men have grown more powerful than we feared. Magic portals, subway cars disappearing off the tracks, fire engines flying through the night sky, and the newer Spider-Man at the center. Webbing and property damage weren't enough. Now we add mystical arts into the mix. Does their desire for destruction know no bounds? I almost feel sorry for this lost soul groomed for a life of criminality and degradation. Speaking of it, 
It seems Spider-Man was cohorting with notorious thief, the Black Cat. Their costumes must be cut from the same corrupt cloth. If their entanglement doesn't paint a clear enough picture of Spider-Man's intent, then here's a little story for you. The Spider-Men show up, and the group we now know as the Hunters follow. Clearer now? These Spider-Men are magnets for malefactors. Now, the Black Cat seems to have vanished. Good riddance! If magic is indeed real, then we must hope upon hope that someone out there is using it for good and will erase the stain in our city known as the Spider-Men. May we go one day without another spider incident. If you can hear me, Marco, not interested in a puppet show. <laughs> I'm trying to help here! Now, where's that sand crystal? I ask them what they want, and all they say is... The beast inside me. But that ain't been me for a long time. Just like I promised you. Marco gave up Sandman for his daughter. And Craven forced it out of him for a stupid hunt. Give me the crystal and I'll be on my way? Sorry guys, but I'm not leaving without that sand crystal. Marco, what's going on in that head of yours? I tell them to leave us alone, but they don't care. They shoot me with a net, try to hold me down, and I was sand before I knew it. I'm so ashamed, but I had no choice. I gotta get back to you. Marco had to do something, or else he'd be just like Scorpion right now. See what else this thing can do. What are you doing? Science, buddy. I'm doing science. <laughs> so, Spider Man, you told MJ, but not your best friend? To protect you. I, I wanted to. 
Right. Yeah, I get it. And that kid you're tutoring, he's the other one? Uh, a lot happened while you were in that tank. Trust me. I know. <laughs> nice and gentle. Whoops. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna make some coffee. It looks like it's gonna be a long night. What the hell happened here? Um, we were, we were just, um, uh, doing some experiments. Where's Dr. Connors? Um, uh, maybe he took the day off? No. He doesn't take days off. I'm gonna go. Yeah. Yeah, I'll call you later. I need a minute. Harry's got superpowers? This is all happening so fast. Wait, what's that? Hey, guys. I'm getting a strange spider bot signal. You got that, too? Uh, Genki, you testing something? I was just about to call you guys. A bunch of them just pinged the network out of nowhere. They're using some funky wireless protocols. I'll check it out and let you know what I find. <clears throat> Looking sharp. Uploading info to the Spidey server. Got it. I'll keep an eye out for more. Send me the data when you find him. I'll try to track down who made him. Hey, long night? Hey, MJ. Harry and I stayed up doing tests on his suit. And we may have had too much pizza. It was really nice. <laughs> Just like the good old days. So I gotta know, what's Harry's radioactive spider? I've never seen anything like this before. It's some kind of exosuit that completely eradicates any trace of his disease. Dr. Connors really outdid himself this time. That's incredible. And great timing, considering what happened at the park. Any leads on where they might have taken Tombstone? Not yet, but if I hear anything, you're my first call. Oh, you're the best. Yeah, I know. Okay, what's next?
think there's some EMF kiosks around here. We like our roads safe. Ish. about Coney Island. First off, the latest news from first responders is many injuries, but no fatalities. Small blessings. But we have got a lot of unknowns. Who perpetrated the attack? Who was the man who helped Spider-Man? I've gotta be honest, folks. This is giving me not good flashbacks to the underground and rocks on brawls of last year. There's hoping that with two Spider-Men in town, we can steer away from more citywide chaos. Anyone who tells you these things happen for a reason should be cursed with wet socks forever. Spiders, got something for you. Head to this location. Felicia? Hey, Felicia. Heard some chatter about the steel foundry in Williamsburg off a radio I swiped from those hunters. Sounds like tombstones there. You could use your help. Thanks. Glad you're all right. Did you make it to Paris in time? Yeah, I did. Figured I owed you one. Both of you. Even if the other Spider-Man couldn't be bothered to make an appearance. Uh, yeah. Uh, you can save the explanation. We've both moved on. He's a good one, by the way. He really is. Well, thanks for the tip. I'm not sure I'd be able to find Tombstone in time without you. Yeah, thanks. Take care of yourself. Those fashion school rejects won't be getting the drop on me again. Ta-ta, spiders. Miles, let me take this one. You're gonna miss your essay deadline. What if... If Lee's there, I'll take care of him. Spider-Man can wait. Miles can't. 
all right. Just keep in touch. Hope Felicia's lead was right. Gotta get to Tombstone before Craven crosses him off his list, too. Expecting company. The data I pulled from that base was right. This is a hunter blind. Maybe I can learn if there's another base nearby. Reinforcements. Consider those hunters hunted. I should look around. Let's see if this thing really does have a bird brain. <laughs> a map of a base. I think I can dig around to see what's waiting for me there. Disabling its relay won't let them call reinforcements. Good to know. Two other blinds. You've been getting around. Have to search the other blinds in Harlem until I find out where the base is. 